So you want to install watchOS update on your Apple Watch, but you don't have enough storage left to do so. What do you do? Here are three steps you can take to fix this. First, remove all your personal content from your watch. This may sound simple, but it may take some time, so do be patient. Go through your audiobooks, music, photos, podcasts, and make sure nothing is synced onto your watch. Also, remember to remove all the apps on your Apple Watch. You can put everything back to its place later on. If you still need to free up more storage, you can take a second step, restart your Apple Watch. A restart can free up some of the storage that has been occupied by your system files, especially when you have just deleted some apps and some of the app data has not been removed completely yet. After a restart, have a check of the storage of your Apple Watch again. If you're still having trouble with the storage and update, take the final, more drastic step. Erase all the content and reset your watch. Give your Apple Watch a breath of fresh air. Do remember, during the setup process, don't sync any data or apps to your Apple Watch yet. Finish updating your watch before putting any of your personal data back on your watch. And that's it! Your storage is back and you can now finally update your Apple Watch. Thank you for watching. This is Clem. Remember to subscribe for more videos and tutorials in the future.